Hi guys! In our previous video, pinag-usapan natin yung pressures in static fluid. Pero bago tayo mag-proceed in solving problems involving pressures in static fluids, pag-usapan muna natin kung ano ba tong tinatawag nating pressure head. Kasi we will be encountering this many times whenever we are solving problems involving fluid mechanics and hydraulics. Kaya it's better na mapag-usapan natin siya ngayon bago pa tayo mag-proceed into other topics. So, ano ba tong tinatawag nating pressure head? So, kunin muna natin yung definition galing dito sa Transport Processes and Unit Operations by Chris Tegin Coplis, no? So, according to this book, a common method of expressing pressures is in terms of head in meters or feet of a particular fluid. The height or head in meters or feet of a given fluid will exert the same pressure as the pressure it represents. But then we have a much clear definition of pressure head right here. Pressure head in fluid mechanics is the pressure exerted by a liquid column on the base of the container. It is represented as the height of the liquid column. So kung naalala ninyo in our previous video, uh, dinederive natin doon yung uh, variation in pressure. No? And then we arrive to this equation right here. We have here the pressure is equal to the density of the fluid times the acceleration due to gravity and the height. And on that example, we are taking H2, which is the total height of our container. No? So in general, we could write this as pressure is equal to rho GH, in which rho is the density of the fluid, G is the acceleration due to gravity, and H is what we call the pressure head. So in solving for the pressure head, we have H is equal to the pressure P over rho G, and this is in SI unit. And for English unit, we have here H is equal to PGC over rho G. Now, if you remember in our previous video, nag-mention tayo na in some references, gumagamit sila ng equation wherein our pressure is represented by the specific weight. So, we have this formula before, no? Pressure is equal to the specific weight times the pressure head. So, in solving using this equation, our head is equal to P over gamma. Okay? Okay, so in order to see the application of this, let us try to solve the problem right here. No? So, if the pressure in a tank is 50 PSI, find the equivalent pressure head of water, B, mercury, and C, heavy fuel oil with a specific gravity of 0.92. So, given ang ating pressure, no? So, ang kailangan nating makuha is yung ating pressure head uh, considering that our fluid is water, mercury, or a heavy fuel oil. So, solving muna natin A, okay, in which our fluid is water, no? Okay, so, all of our given are in English unit, no? So, let us try to use this equation right here. Itong gamitin natin in solving these problems. Okay? So, let us again come here. So, gagamitin natin ang ating equation. H is equal to pressure GC over rho G. Okay? So, yan ang gagamitin natin. So, first, our H is equal to Ang given pressure natin is 50 pounds per square inch, no? PSI. So, we have 50 pound force per square inch, okay? So, yan ang ating given pressure. Well, lahat ng ating given here, including yung density, is expressed in feet, no? So, that means we have to convert our inches into foot. And to do that, we know that in one foot, we have 12 inches, okay? Then, we have to square this in order to cancel these units right there, okay? And then, our GC. Our GC, katulad nung napag-usapan natin sa previous video, this is equal to 32.174 pound mass feet per pound force second squared. 
Okay, so ang ating density ng water, ang density ng water is 62.4 pound mass per feet cube. So we have 62.4 pound mass per feet cube. And then, ang ating G. Ang ating G is equal to 32.174 feet per second squared. Okay, so nasulat na natin lahat, no? So, we have to check now our units. Our pound force will be cancelled out. Inches squared will be cancelled out. Pound mass will be cancelled out. Okay, and ating second squared will be cancelled out. Okay, so we have feet squared here. We have foot, we have feet cube, and feet. So, finally, our unit here will be in feet. Okay? So, now let us solve for our pressure head. Our pressure head is equal to 50 times 12 squared times 32.174 divided by 62.4 and divided by 32.174. Our answer will be 115.38 feet. Well, this is our final answer for our A, having a fluid of water. Bago tayo magpatuloy sa ating discussion, we would like to ask for your support by subscribing sa ating YouTube channel. Please click on the notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa mga videos na ipopost namin. So, ngayon naman, sagot na naman natin itong B, wherein ang ating fluid is mercury. No? So, pareho pa rin ang gagamitin nating equation. So, H is equal to pressure GC over rho G. Okay? So, hindi na natin isusulat yung unit natin kasi it will be the same here. So, numerical lang ang ating gagawing calculation ngayon, no? So, we have H is equal to, our pressure is equal to 50 PSI. Then, to convert that to feet squared, we have to multiply it by 12 squared. And then, ang ating GC which is 32.174 divided by ang density ng mercury we have here 847.3 so 847.3 and then multiplied to our G which is 32.174 so finally our H is equal to 50 times 12 squared times 32.174 divided by 847.3 and divided by 32.174. Our pressure head is equal to 8.4976 feet. So, this is our answer uh, for B wherein our fluid is mercury. So, let us now solve problem C. And in problem C, ang fluid natin is heavy oil. Okay? Wherein, ang specific gravity niya, so take note, no? Ang specific gravity ang ating given, no? Which is 0 0.92. So, specific gravity is equal to 0 0.92. 92. Okay, so let us now solve this. Same equation ang gagamitin natin. Pressure head is equal to pressure GC over density times G. So, our pressure head is equal to ang ating pressure which is 50 PSI. Convert that to feet squared. We have uh, 12 squared. Ang ating GC is 32.174. And then, take note, ang given natin is specific gravity, which is 0 0.92. So, therefore, to convert that into density, we have to multiply this to the density of water, which is 62.4. Right? And then, our G, which is 32.174. Okay? 
Okay, so this will be cancelled out. Okay, katulad ng ginagawa natin kanina. So, our pressure head is equal to 50 times 12 squared divided by 0 0.92 divided by 62.4 is equal to 125.42 feet. And this is our final answer for our C, wherein our fluid is heavy fuel oil. Well, that's it for now, guys, and thank you for watching. We are inviting you to register sa www.engineers.org. It is a community of Filipino engineers, engineering students, and STEM students. Thank you very much, and have a nice day!